everyone, I'm Terry G. Thanks a lot for stopping by and watching my video. If you could take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? I'd really appreciate it. And again, thanks a lot for stopping by. What I wanna talk about today, I wanna to talk about being a dry drunk and what exactly is a dry drunk? You may hear another word that is very similar or what describes being a dry drunk and what that is, is white knuckling it. And basically, what is a dry drunk? Well, a dry drunk is a person who goes into recovery but does nothing about changing their life whatsoever. The funny thing about alcoholism is that it does not stop because we put a plug on the jug. We still carry the same behaviors, the same coping mechanisms that we did when we used alcohol. And when we don't have the booze to sort of put those flames out to help us soothe ourselves with life one day at a time with ourselves inside and out, we become dry drunks. And a dry drunk is a terrible way to live. You know, people used to walk up to me and say, Terry, you must be white knuckling it. And I wonder what the hell they meant. And that's basically what it is, is that you're white knuckling it. Just picture being on a cliff, just holding on for dear life. And your life is so miserable because you don't have the booze and you're walking around coping with things and you're just losing your mind because, you know, that's just the way it is. The old saying is in Alcoholics Anonymous, I heard, if you sober up a drunken horse thief, he's still a drunken, he's still a horse thief. And that's basically what it is. Alcoholism is progressive even when you stop the booze. What are some of the signs of being a dry drunk? Now, I know for a fact, these are signs that when I was a dry drunk in early recovery, I was moody as hell. I was up and down moody, roller coaster moody. I did a, a video on that before, and that's exactly the way I was. You know, one minute I was happy, next minute I was crying, next minute I was angry as hell at you. All those kind of things I used to do. So very moody and up and down. Another thing, wishing I could drink again. Fantasizing about the good old days about drinking. Oh, I wish I could drink. If I could drink, all my problems would be over. That's another thing. Another one is relationships. Your relationships with your friends, your family, your workplace will more likely suck. And you'll always have crises within those relationships. I know I did. I was fighting with my wife. I was fighting with the person who cut the grass. I was fighting all the time. And that pretty well goes with being moody. You will hold resentments like crazy. Oh, you'll resent everybody and you'll reminisce about those resentments. And you know, that's what I did. I did a lot of that and I isolated also. These symptoms that I just described of are basically general, general captions of what a dry drunk is. But basically a dry drunk is somebody who quits alcohol that does no change, does not change your life. Doesn't work your steps if you're in a 12-step program, maybe doesn't go to therapy, when asked by his wife or friends, you should go and talk to somebody in therapy, does nothing, just quits the booze. And if you're an alcoholic like I was, or I am an alcoholic, I'm a recovering alcoholic, and you do nothing about your lifestyle when you quit drinking, it makes it very, very difficult to change and get that sense of ease and comfort in your life. My coping mechanisms, the way I thought about myself, the way I dealt with myself and the world around me was so out of whack when I quit drinking, I was a super dry drunk and it was very difficult to cope with my life one day at a time. But there's tons of help, help out there for people who are dry drunks. But the best thing you can do is get into a 12-step recovery group talk to like-minded like, like people and start changing your life. I'm gonna do another video on things we can do to change our lives to help us with the dry drunk scenario. But if you're feeling that you're just white knuckling it and you're hanging on to just the dear life of sobriety, you are probably a dry drunk, really are. Basically, yep, that's probably what it is, okay? I'm just rambling on a little bit here now. 
I just want to thank everybody for stopping by and watching my video. If you could take a second, can you please subscribe to my channel? This is an alcohol free life channel where we learn to live sober one day at a time. Hit that subscribe button, smash that like button, and I'll see you next time next week. And like I said before, we're all in this together. God bless, stay safe, stay sober, and I'll see you next time. Ciao for now. Bye for now.